Hello, welcome back to Miss Bell's channel. Today we will be talking about sleep and dream facts. Um, I hope that they can help put you to sleep and that you learn some things about sleep. And I hope that you learn a lot or maybe just get a refresher today. And feel free to take some notes. First fact is a giraffe only needs 1.9 hours of sleep a day, whereas a brown bat needs 19.9 hours a day. It's a huge difference. Okay, sleep deprivation will kill you more quickly than food deprivation. Experts have discovered a direct link between people's favorite sleeping positions and their personalities. Forty one percent of British population sleeps in the fetal position. born blind experience dreams involving things such as emotion, sound, and smell, rather than sight. Sea otters hold hands when they sleep so they don't drift away from each other. Fear is said not to be the main emotion in nightmares. And it says that more, most of the time, it's sadness, guilt, and confusion in dreams. Sleeping on your front can aid digestion need help with that. Humans are the only mammals that willingly delay sleep. Okay, so raise your hand if you ever have trouble waking up on Monday mornings. A lot of us. So, you can blame your social jet lag for that, for your altered weekend sleep schedule. It's normal to feel kind of tired on Monday mornings. So your schedule changes on the weekends. Tiredness peaks twice a day at 2 a.m. and 2 p.m. That's why you're less alert after lunch. Research shows that you will sleep better during a new moon and worse during a full moon, although the reasons are unclear why. Okay, so if it takes you less than five minutes to fall asleep at night, you're probably sleep deprived. Ideally, falling asleep should take around 10 to 15 minutes. Stress, physical or mental illness, living or sleeping arrangements, family history, shift work, diet and exercise habits can all cause insomnia. So just your lifestyle can affect that. English Bulldogs are the only canines known to suffer from sleep apnea, which is a breathing disorder. Their unusual airway anatomy, they have short snouts and underbites, is likely the reason why they suffer from that. Is 
Insomnia is not defined by the sleep you lose each night, but by the drowsiness, difficulty concentrating, headaches, irritability, and other problems it causes each day. Being awake for 16 hours straight decreases your performance as much as if your blood alcohol were 0.05 percent and it's interesting because the legal limit is 0.08 percent so being tired might affect your driving or your thinking raise your hand if you find it really hard to get out of bed in the morning me too so that's called dysania and it actually may signal a nutritional deficiency, depression, or other problems if you feel that way. Okay, so doing without sleep is likely to make you hungry as levels of leptin, an appetite regulating hormone, fall. In the 17th century, getting up in the middle of the night was normal. People slept in two segments, divided by an hour or two of alertness. Time for reading, praying, intimacy, or socializing with others. One in four married couples sleep in separate beds. Sleeping on the job is less of a problem in Japan. Companies may accept it as a sign of exhaustion from overworking. Some car rental contracts make you promise not to drive on fewer than six hours of sleep. less likely to have a traffic accident when daylight saving time ends. Statistics show that the extra hour of sleep reduces accidents. Regular exercise usually improves your sleep patterns. Exercising sporadically or right before bed may keep you up, actually. So you don't want to exercise right before bed, usually earlier in the day. Morning. Okay, one job in early English mill and factory towns was to knock on people's windows to wake them up for work. So that would be kind of like their alarm clock. Be a fun job. One of our biggest sleep distractions is 24 hour internet access. So everyone needs to get off the internet and just try to go to bed. Whales and dolphins literally fall half asleep. Each side of their brain takes turns so they can come up for air. Interesting. Today, 75% of us dream in color. Before color television, just 15% of us did. Insomnia is often a normal part of grieving. Taking sleeping pills can actually disrupt this process. So raise your hand if you have a guess about what's the record for the longest period without sleep. Yes. It's not five days. It's more. Mm -hmm. Not ten, it's more. It's not twelve, it's actually eleven. So eleven days is the record for the longest period without sleep. And definitely don't want to do that though. 
It's just it probably will not do great things to your body. It's common for people who are deaf to sign in their sleep. Just like when people talk in their sleep, people who are deaf sometimes sign in their sleep. Parasomnia is a term that refers to unnatural movements during your sleep and some people have even committed crime due to parasomnia including sleep driving and even murder So babies steal 1,055 hours from their parents of sleep and it's the average of it, so it's about 44 days of sleep per year from their sleepless newborn. <laughs> it's a lot of hours. Humans can actually sleep with their eyes open, which makes it truly impossible to tell whether someone is sleeping or not sleeping. So, this was um, based on a study in a Sleep in America poll in 2008. So, it said a surprising 34% of respondents reported their employer allows them to nap during breaks and 16% provide a place to do so. Okay. Altitude disrupts your sleep. So due to the lower amounts of oxygen at altitudes of 13,200 feet or higher, it's much harder to sleep. So be careful next time you visit those mountains. Okay. You grow 0.3 inches while you sleep, but it's temporary because throughout the day you actually shrink back down. You can't sneeze while sleeping. So, scientists still don't know, and probably will never know, if animals dream during REM sleep as humans do. When infants are put to bed drowsy but not asleep, they are more likely to become self-soothers, which enables them to fall asleep independently at bedtime and put themselves back to sleep during the night. The strangers in your dreams aren't strangers, so you might not know them personally, but you've seen everyone in your dreams before. So every person that you have seen in your life could be in your dream, even if you don't recognize that person. Because your brain can't create new faces. It will just take faces that you've seen in your life. Caffeine has been called the most popular drug in the world. All over the world, people consume it on a daily basis. And can definitely affect your sleep. Newborns sleep a total of 14 to 17 hours a day on an irregular schedule with periods of one to three hours spent awake. According to the International Classifications of Sleep Disorders, Shift workers are at an increased risk for a variety of chronic illnesses such as cardiovascular and gastrointestinal diseases. Snoring is the primary cause of sleep disruption for approximately 90 million Americans and 37 million on a regular basis suffer from the snoring waking them up. Eating 
82% of healthcare professionals believe that it is the responsibility of both the patient and the healthcare professional to bring up symptoms of insomnia during an appointment. So, according to the Sleep Poll in America in 2008, 36% of Americans drive drowsy or actually fall asleep while driving. It's pretty scary. Okay, so people who don't get enough sleep are more likely to have bigger appetites due to the fact that their leptin levels and it, that's an appetite regulating hormone fall and that promotes an appetite increase. Seasonal affective disorder is believed to be influenced by the changing patterns of light and darkness that occur with the approach of winter, which maybe could affect your sleep. So if you're being trouble right now, it might be that you have a little bit of the seasonal affective disorder affecting you. You can actually jolt yourself awake. Raise your hand if you've ever done this before. Yeah, so it's not unusual to feel like you're physically falling while you're asleep. This feeling can trigger your limbs to jolt yourself awake. And your body, when you're sleeping, is typically temporarily paralyzed while you're sleeping, but the paralysis hasn't happened yet during the earliest, lightest sleep stage, so you might experience that jolt. You have dreams even if you don't remember them. So, we're just going to give a guess about how many dreams the average person has a night. One, it's not one. It's more than that. Two, it's not two. It's not three. It's four to six dreams a night, but most people can't recall them. It's very hard. So if you want to recall them, what you could do is just take notes on them as soon as you wake up. But if you wake up, usually you remember it right away and then it goes away. Two-thirds of a cat's life is spent asleep. So if you have a cat, this probably isn't very surprising. Cats like to sleep a lot. So pain tolerance is reduced by sleep deprivation. So it's suggested that when you when a person doesn't sleep as much. It reduces their pain threshold, but they're not 100% sure why that happens. Okay, so we kind of talked about this earlier, but here's the stats of it. Within five minutes of waking up, 50% of your dream is forgotten. So, after an additional five minutes, 90% of the recollection is gone. That is all the sleep facts that I have for you today. Um, I hope that you have restful dreams and you learned or refreshed on some dream and sleep facts. Good night.